For southern pine forests, fire is an instrument used to enhance them. It helps remove competition for essential nutrients and allows sunlight to penetrate, making fire an essential and useful tool. Our southern pines, longleaf pine, southern uh, shortleaf pine, loblolly and, and slash pine, they really benefit from burns, from prescribed burns. And uh, it's just something that they've grown up with together. There is much more to a prescribed burn than just striking a match. Participants in the certification course learned about what conditions were favorable for burning and when prescribed burns should not be conducted. Uh, to, through education uh, that goes along with the certification, then uh, we can assure that people understand what are the conditions that will cause you to have problems and how to avoid those problems. The people attending the certification represented a diverse group, which is typical for a prescribed burn class. We've had a mix of people who are uh, profession, in professional land management. We've had um, state employees. We've had uh, quite a few uh, private landowners, too. One of the advantages of successfully completing the course is it provides some liability protection. The course also alerts the attendees of where to find useful resources. The information we've gotten on the fire weather and how to go find the information from the National Weather Service has been a big help because I did not know how to go look that up and get it, and that's, that's going to uh, be a big help. Prescribed burns are typically performed on tracts of land every three to five years. With the LSU Ag Center, this is Craig Gotro reporting.